What is up, Madden NFL 15 fans? Welcome to today's video. Today we're going to be talking some more about Madden 15 content and kind of what they're bringing to the game. Really quickly, though, I want to continue to uh, just remind you that I got an interview up over at my YouTube channel with S. Gibbs from MaddenTips.com, and we are talking about what it takes to go from being just an average gamer to being a really elite tournament level uh, gamer in Madden. And so it's a really good article. It's a really good uh, video, and uh, I really think that you guys can learn a lot from it. So you want to go check that out i'll leave a link in the description for you also guys if you haven't seen the madden 15 gameplay video yet you can check that out in the link below as well now really quickly here i want to run through this uh, i've got some mutt gameplay mutt gameplay up from the background if you guys notice the guy literally ran two men under the entire game and um you know it's just stuff like that that really kind of frustrates me as a as a madden player and someone that really gets kind of frustrated with the game uh on the little things and i think the guys you know, part of be part of being a better gamer is at least having the ability to call more than one play on defense. And so, two man under is very good, but it's not the only play. And you can see I just lit him up, torched it over and over again. Just hit that drag or those uh, crossing patterns against two man under. It's very simple to beat it. And uh, we've got a lot of tips on my YouTube channel about how to do that. But Anyway, today we're going to talk about the presentation and the broadcast for Madden 15. Now, if you guys checked out that gameplay, you did notice uh, some different types of broadcast, uh, some more, uh, really more TV-like broadcasts, and it's because they brought in this guy from NFL Films, and I think that that was a freaking amazing uh, pickup. Brian Murray, cinematographer, uh, former NFL film senior cinematographer Brian Murray serves as presentation director of Madden NFL 15. And I really, really like where they're going with the presentation because it's becoming a lot more realistic. It's becoming a lot more almost as if we were watching it on our TVs. And uh, I really am excited about that just because it's, it's, it's just the little things, guys. It really excites me about Mad 15. And, uh, you know, we see a lot of different uh, good transitions, I think, that we didn't see in the previous Maddens. You know, we have, you know, when they're talking about some spotlighting players, they're not always talking about just, you know, the quarterback, unless the quarterback's like an elite quarterback like Russell Wilson or Aaron Rodgers. Or they're not always talking about, you know, the defensive line. You know, they could be talking about the linebackers. They could be talking about the matchups or something like that. You know, different things that they're doing. And uh, I really do like the way that the whole transitions of, of each play to play is looking and I love the new broadcast elements uh, the Madden development team placed a heavy emphasis on broadcast banners and trying new commentary back to them so every banner of the game has been retouched to reflect the look and feel of an authentic NFL broadcast now if you notice there were some pictures some guys put up on Twitter and uh, basically they compared Madden 15's broadcast to that of a actual TV and it looked almost identical and that really excites me for the game because it just it just has a lot of fundamentals of real life and it's kind of a direction I think and I think that if Madden 15 I think Madden 15 really loses kind of the sight and this is what I really want to talk about in the commentary more so than just the presentations but if Madden 15 continues to go in directions like they're going right now this game will continue to get better and better the problem is when they go in the same direction for three years uh, backwards for example, Madden 12, Madden 13, Madden 25 all basically play the same for the most part. Not 100%, but for the most part. There's obviously different nuances and different blitzes that work better in, in different games. But in general, guys, the way that the fundamental mechanics of the game play, it's very similar, especially on current gen. Uh, next gen, it did provide a lot, of, a lot of features, but I'm really, really excited because the way that they're working on the mechanics is really uh, getting me pumped because... Over the last couple of years, we've seen a lot of work into MUT, or we've seen a lot of work into Franchise Mode, or we've seen a lot of work into all these other modes, and I think that if Madden would just continue to focus on making the game as realistic as possible, instead of trying to provide many, many, many features, they would be a lot better, uh, a lot better uh, received and a lot better not uh, notified. And, and, and I think that it just adds to the fundamental that if, if Madden 15, if they can just keep going in this direction, then they will be so much better for it. And uh, I like this one right here. Uh, new broadcast banners and montages tell dynamic stories about how players are performing. For example, guys, you know, you've seen sometimes where like you're... 
your your linebacker will give up a terrible touchdown and then just jog back to the sideline. Whereas in the real NFL, you know, you see him slapping the ground or you see him getting really upset and just the emotion, the raw intensity of the game. And they're bringing that back with these player montages and, and different broadcasts that they've got coming in. So I really do like all of the direction that Madden 15 is going in. And uh, we're going to talk uh, next video about the play calling system and the graphics. But I really do enjoy this. Um, and then finally, I want to close with this. Pre-game and halftime shows. Local sports director Larry Ridley leads an all-new intro sequence before games, calling out specific matchups and other tidbits to keep an eye on during the game. The halftime show also includes broadcast-style graphics as well as fantasy ticker with player stats on the bottom of the screen. During halftime, Larry will also break down some of the game's highlights with all-new audio recordings. This is a huge addition to Madden. It's long overdue. Uh, you know, one of the things that I really liked doing when I was, if, if I play MLB or even NBA, was the way that you would get the matchups while the game was loading up. And I really, really wish that they would do that with Madden. Instead of seeing that same old stupid loading screen where they talk about all the different features, really talk some more about the actual game that you're getting ready to play. So I like that addition. I think they're going in the right direction. But overall, guys, what do you think about the presentation and the direction that they're going? Does it really matter to you? Um, obviously, I'm more concerned about gameplay. But what do you think about the new presentation? And what are your thoughts on this article from EA Sports? Thanks, guys, for watching. Hope this video uh, had a little bit of Madden 15 content in for you that you could enjoy. And uh, we'll talk more in the future. Thanks, guys.